Hello, dear viewer, and welcome back to this KOTOR Let's Play on iPad. We are escaping the Leviathan! Hopefully. I don't know, we just took out Saul Karath, who had uh, betrayed the Republic, and Karth, and bombed Telos, Karth's homeworld. So, you know, I think Karth's doing alright. But now we gotta figure out which way to go. Anything in here? Ooh, I missed this. Okay, did I get these other ones? Apparently not. Okay. Well, we got some more grenades. Leviathan is great at giving you grenades. Now the question is, how do we get to our hangar? Hmm. Well, let's save real fast. And perhaps this will not lead to our doom. Okay, command deck. Mm -hmm. Alright, so, there's the elevator. That can probably take us to the hangar. Looks like the straightest path is almost straight ahead. So we'll do that. A couple twists and turns. You know. Now, if my party was all Jedi, we could all use master speed. And life would be faster. Oh! Well, here are two guys that apparently are new. We'll do this. Do that. Okay, perfect. Now we engage. Eh, we'll start pretty powerful, I think. Okay, so Jalanon's going. Is anybody else doing anything? Wow, guys. Wow. No help, huh? Okay. Master Rapid Shot. Bastila. Use that flurry. Oh. They knocked down Jalanon. <laughs> well, we're taking them down. Okay. Really taking them down. Then we have the Grenadier. And that's why people are falling down. Okay, anything else? Hmm. Not that I'm seeing. Let's heal real fast. Heal as well. Alright, everybody's back to full. It's nice to spread the healing. Okay. Poison grenade. Thank you for that, sir. And for not throwing it at my face. Great. Another grenadier. Hmm. And my buff is gone. Same for Bastila. And Karth, you go on ahead. Yoink. Yoink. That worked pretty well. Okay, and another one. Wow. Hmm. Well, we're all going to fall. No, no we didn't. Hmm. I thought I got that grenade off, but apparently not. Oh, oops. Wrong way. This way to the elevator. Hmm. You know, I wonder if we can just farm for experience here. But we're not going to do that. We're going to go to the hangar. We're actually doing pretty good on experience points, as far as I can tell. I am. I think I'm level 16? 17, technically, on Jalanon. Hmm. Okay. Yes, what's on your mind? Oh. Well, this seems like the wrong time for a conversation, as we're leaving the exploding ship, but... Do you think you'll see Dustal again? I think so. If he's anything like he used to be, Dustal hates to be tricked. There's no way he'll let this sort of treachery go on. So whether or not it'll be my son again, I, I don't know. He still sort of bugs me. He's an exception to Tilo. Maybe we can work it out. I, I hope so. I, I guess I'll have to wait and see. Thanks, by the way, for all your help. Yeah. No problem, good buddy. Okay, so there's the elevator door. Right? Yeah. Okay. It's Kandra. We took care of the guards. We're inside the Ebon Hawk and all systems are go. As soon as you guys join us, we can get out of here. All right, to the Ebon Hawk. Ooh, wait, door. Hi, guys. Master Valor. Master Speed. Karth. No, Karth, what are you doing? Oh my gosh. Okay, here we go. Start defeating people. Why is Karth in the middle? <laughs> oh my goodness. This is not the best thing. Wait, why are you using a force power? Oh, Bastila. 
Ah, well. We'll get it done. These are a bunch of noob troopers. Hmm. Okay, we're good. Yep, collecting that experience. Checking for some items. As we run for our lives. Okay, okay. Because what is life without a few more extra grenades you're never going to use, right? Hmm, let's see, remains. Ah, wait. There we go. Click. Okay. Hmm. Another standard door. And a Dark Jedi Master. Wonderful. Buffs. Definitely buffs. Okay. Did I ask to do Master Speed yet? Hmm. Do? Doesn't look like it. Yeah, it's still doing good damage, though. That flurry, I think, is better than power attack. Hmm. It's. I think power attack is better with master speed than it otherwise would ever be. Uh, which you know, everything is better with more speed, of course. But <laughs> it's. Um, I think it's nice for if you have high defense enemies. But honestly, it seems like just more attacks is better. You get a higher chance of hitting things. You get more damage in. Higher chance for criticals. So, I mean, if I was going to replay this, I would probably play a scout with a double-bladed lightsaber. Um, basically, a more tough version of Bastila. Hmm. Possibly more skilled as well. Because, I mean, Joe Lee can definitely get a lot of different Jedi powers. Since he's neutral, he can get Sith powers as well without super um, high costs. So that is nice. Hmm. And Zalbar, I mean, come on. Zalbar's just always good. Okay, let's see. Lots of Sith. Again. But it seems like it's not even worth buffing before any of your fights, because you never know if they'll just get rid of your buffs when you go into a new room. Okay. Karth. Master Rapid Shot. Master. Did she use Master Speed yet? Doesn't look like it. We'll do it. Then we'll attack. Alright. Okay. Well, Sith. This is how the cookie crumbles. With lightsabers, I guess. Hmm. Who knew? So useful, lightsabers. Okay. Okay. Ah. Here's a wonderful view of the Ebon Hawk. Yeah, it is kind of nice to see it in full view for once. Not running away into the stars, not just sitting around in front of your face. We can't actually open that door. But maybe we can get this metal box open. Aha. And this metal box as well. Okay, everybody's up to full. Hmm, it's a blast door. Okay, never mind. We did not have to blast it open. Hmm. Everything has a more reddish light now, I guess. Hmm. Oh. This is probably why. Darth Malik. Down you go. No, Karth. No. Reunion? What are you talking about? Why did the Jedi spare me? I don't understand. This meeting was inevitable, Malak. Hmm. Um, what? we'll do Reunion. <laughs> you mean you don't know? <laughs> All this time and you still haven't figured it out. <laughs> I wonder how long you would have stayed blind to the truth. Surely some of what you once were must have surfaced by now. 
of your true identity buried forever, Kuni. The Jedi do not believe in killing their prisoners. No one deserves execution, no matter what their crimes. The Council would not normally accept an adult for training, but this is a special case. They say the Force can do terrible things to a mind. It can wipe away your memories and destroy your very identity. All the little clues. Tatooine. Kashik. Manan. Corlin. Revan visited each of these worlds searching for clues to reveal the hidden location of the Starforge. The lure of the dark side is difficult to resist. I fear this quest to find the Star Forge will lead you down an all too familiar path. What greater weapon is there than to turn an enemy to your cause, to use their own knowledge against them? This is a really good way to reveal all this. Thank goodness my eyes didn't stay yellow when my mind was wiped. That would have been a dead giveaway. I'm Darth Revan. How is that possible? I cannot yet remember, Revan. The Jedi set a trap. They lured us into battle against the Small Republic fleet. During the attack, a team of Jedi Knights boarded your ship. The Jedi strike team captured you, and the Council used the Force to reprogram your mind. They wiped away your identity and turned you against your own followers. Hmm. I think they just let me resurface as what I once was. Hmm. Do you mean I'm really your master? I served you, Revan. But I always knew that one day the title of Dark Lord would be mine. When that Jedi strike team boarded your vessel, I saw my day had come. I ordered my own ships to fire on your bridge. I thought I could destroy all my enemies with a single glorious victory. I never dreamed the Jedi would take you alive from the wreckage. Hmm. Why would the Jedi simply kill me? Even though we heard a quote that already said why, but Jedi yeah. Fools. They do not believe in executing prisoners. Originally, I assumed you would die in the battle. Imagine my surprise when I found out you were still alive, Revan. But why did you betray? Your master. You mean why did I betray you, Revan? You are the one who taught me the ways of the Sith. The strongest must rule if we are to survive. You knew I would one day challenge you for supremacy, but you underestimated me. I acted sooner than you expected and seized the Sith throne with a single brilliant stroke. Hmm. Which, you know... I mean, considering that you can never stop watching your back with the Sith, no wonder friendships don't last <laughs> in the whole dark side realm of things, man. Anyway, Bastila, is this true? It's true. I was part of the team sent to capture Revan, to capture you. 
When Malik fired on the ship, you were badly injured. We thought you were dead. Your mind was destroyed, but I used the Force to preserve the flicker of life in your body. I brought you to the Jedi Council. They were the ones who healed your damaged mind. Hmm. Then why don't I remember being Revan? The Jedi Council didn't restore your wounded mind, Revan. They merely programmed it with a new identity, one loyal to the Republic. They tried to make you their slave. Hmm. I understand, Bastila. You had no other choice. Hey, you're the one that said it, not me. Chance to prove myself. Once I defeat you in combat, no one will question my claim to the Sith throne. My triumph will be complete. Hmm. Your power is no match for the light. Well, this is awkward. Do this. And then... Hmm. Force Aura? Master Valor? Yeah, let's do Master Valor. So hopefully stuff like that won't keep happening. Um, energy Resistance. Okay. He's just pushing me and not doing much damage, so great. I'll just keep buffing. Nice. Okay. Let's attack. Okay. Or he's just going to keep pushing me. Weird. Okay. Nope. Master power attack. That's what I thought, Darth Malak. Your arrogance would be... Oh, okay. Well. Never mind. <laughs> Running away. That's right, punk. Okay, it's locked. Well, you guys back to normal? Hello? No? Hmm. Any of these doors open? Okay. Yeah, they do. Well, first we're going to heal, because it would be dumb not to. Uh, I'd love to buff, but I honestly don't know if he'll let me or not. Hmm. Especially if they do another cutscene. It always seems to get rid of those. So, it looks like we're going to have to be sneaky about finding Malik. Come out, come out, wherever you are. Okay. Hangar bay? Well, at least we made it to the hangar. Nope. No, we didn't. Well, all right, Malik. We'll play Ring Around the Rosie till I find you, I suppose. Hmm. Wait, really? What's he trying to do with this? You guys separate me from my friends? I mean, that would work if I hadn't already kicked his butt. Hmm. Well, okay. Unless something weird happened. Hmm. Or he's in the center and I have to find the one that will let me into the center. Okay. Hmm. Great. Okay, will this one let me in? Nope. We're going to speed this up a little bit. Okay, you. Let me in. There we go. Oh, now you're trying to look cool? Okay, well, we're gonna buff again if you do the same thing. Looks like he is being kind of arrogant. Okay, good. Force R. Okay, now he's being less arrogant and actually attacking. But not enough. Uh -huh. 
You two get out of here. Find the Starforge. Ah. No, Vastalite, he's too strong. No! The door sealed. We can't get past. Come on, we have to get to the Ebon Hawk. What about Bastila? We have to help her. Bastila doesn't stand a chance against Malak. We can't help her. Not here. We have to get off this ship and find the Star Forge. That's the key to beating the Dark Lord. Bastila sacrificed herself so we could get away. We can't have her sacrificed in vain. Come on! Man, poor Bastila. She got tortured the most. She's captured with Malak, probably. Hmm. Me not happy. Okay. Well, let's heal in case there's more stormtroopers and stuff, Karth. Oh, we're going to find this Starforge. And we are going to find Bastila afterwards. Because Malak will have to find us. Or at least come get us at the Starforge. I guess the ship's in better uh, health than I thought. Hmm. That's a cool fighter design. Well, I'm guessing this is going to be another one of those. Yep. Uh, where are they? They're there. Well, I'm out of practice. Damn, they're really hard to see. Mm -hmm. Well. Ah, there's one. No, come back. I can barely see you all. Okay. Hopefully this won't destroy eyes. Okay, let's see. Come on, you Sith Lord people who aren't Sith Lords at all, but uh... Man. No, no, shoot, shoot! Okay. That looked like it might have gotten a glancing hit. There we go. So maybe they all follow predetermined paths. Let's follow that one. Yeah, it's going pretty much straight. I'm trying to lead it, but it's you know, not working very well. Okay, there we go. Mm hmm. There's one. Okay, good. Flew into us. There's that one. So they do follow predetermined paths, apparently. Hmm. Or at least, you know, paths where we can shoot them. No, that guy's not going to fire. Okay. Okay. If only we could shoot the Leviathan. Sure. Okay. There it is. Hmm. There we go. Whew. Well, the Ebon Hawk is making its merry way out of this mess. But we have lost a precious crew member. Hmm. Where is Bastila? What happened on that ship? We ran into Malak. He would have killed us, but Bastila sacrificed herself so we could get away. She's... she's dead? He'll want to use her battle meditation against the Republic. Turn her to the dark side, and the Sith will always be victorious. Hmm. Well, I want to go back for Bastila, because honestly, I think we can take Malak. But, you know what? The game's saying we have to go to the Starforge first. Hmm. But first, let's just see what they say. We have to go back for Bastila. Not so fast. We've got a bigger issue to deal with here. They deserve to know the truth about you. Do you want to tell them what Malik said, or should I? Oh, that's true. I'll tell them. I'm I'm Darth Riven. What, what are you talking about? This is kind of a joke. No, it's no joke. We 
Jedi Council captured Revan and erased the Dark Lord's mind, programming in a new identity. Saul Karen told me on the Leviathan, and that door can close. You're Darth Revan? This is... this is big! Do you... do you remember anything about being a Dark Lord? Hmm. Small bits of few strange dreams and visions, that's all. Oh, how do mission. We know more memories won't come flooding back. How do we know Revan won't suddenly turn on us? The whole time we've been chasing after Malak, we've had his old Sith master right at our side, listening to our secrets, hearing our plans. But I'm not the Dark Lord anymore. I'm Jalanon. I'm one of you. I don't see the Sith Lord standing here. I see a friend who's been with us through thick and thin. Remember, Malak's the one who tried to destroy Karak. <laughs> I agree with mission. I swore a life debt to the person you are, not to the person you were. Big Z and I will stick by you. We owe you our lives. We won't desert you now. How can you say that, mission? The Sith bombed my homeworld, Revan took away my family, and destroyed my life. Everyone knows it was Malak who gave the order to attack your people, Karth. You can't blame Revan for that. I suppose you've proven yourself to be a friend of the Republic by your actions so far. Oh, HK-47. Oh my gosh. Well, Karth, will you stand with me against Malak? Another sin of justice. And I don't see any other way that we can stop the Sith. And I suppose that Malak is the real enemy here. We still have no other choice, do we? I'm not Revan anymore, Karth. You have to believe that. I want to believe it. You've proven yourself time and time again during our mission, but this is a little much for me to wrap my mind around. You have to try, for Bastila's sake. Must be even more of a shock to you. I don't know how you can keep going. I guess we both just have to find a way to push forward. Or I won't let my personal feelings get in the way of my assignments or this mission. But don't forget, I've sworn an oath to defend the Republic. As long as this mission stays on course, I'll stick with you. But I won't let you betray the Republic under any circumstances. So I guess that's it then. Gotta keep going. We've still got one more star map to uncover if we're gonna find that Starforge and save Bastila, so let's do it before it's too late. That's right. I think it's Manon that we have to go to. Hmm. Well, we'll get it done, and we'll save Bastila. But for now, I guess we find a hangar. Hmm. Is this a Republic ship? Okay. Well, I think we're going to leave it here for today, folks. <sighs> well, if you liked this video, then leave a like. And if you want to see more, please subscribe. Have a good day, dear viewer.